got Europeans yeah. and, yeah, and yeah. heavily amalgamated they didn't, Asians. They didn't view things on the eye to eye perspective and everything yeah. because number one, though, W. E. Du Bois did not even recognize himself as an African American due to his history of of, of, of generations being that. I think it was his grandfather or his grandmother that was white and European or something like that too though. You said you were Moorish American. So, I mean, that's I, put I, you on I, the I'm, I'm, like, I'm, I'm just going to say this though. I've studied, studied you know, sure the history of the Moorish Americans when I was incarcerated. You know, me and a brother, I, I met a brother that was from out of Chicago that was a Muslim. Yeah. So we in the feds and everything and I had, you know, me and me, back and forth. Nah, me and the brother, I took a liking to the brother because he was, he was like, even though he had a lot of, he had a, he was facing a lot of time and everything, you know, but he still remained humble to the aspect, you know, of, of, of Islam. So I asked him, I was like, yo, brother, you know, I want to come to Juma services. He said, all right, no problem, come to Juma. So then. Me going in one door, and they had another class of the Moors in another door, and I walked through that door. Yeah. So you know, I kind of like, uh -huh. I said, well, maybe you know, this is this was like meant for me to walk through these doors right here. Uh -huh. So being that I, it wasn't no accident. I don't take it as an accident. Okay, I take okay. it as a force. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That was leading me in a direction of you know finding out what part of history you know what I'm saying that can be generated and through educating myself. When you say in the more science of America, we said that there are no happens, that law governs all no of us. So no man is sure to find himself when he's going to solve his problems best. No you know what I mean? So I, I, don't, I don't take nothing by chance. You know what I'm saying? Because as long as I'm in tune with the universe and everything around it, I understand things that they happen because that's the way it was designed to happen. That's good. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Money means rape, baby. Baby? Yeah, baby. Lawrence Pacquiao. It's a pleasure to meet you, I'm trying to look for a car from the Morris Science Tip. I'm a part of a member of Tip for 21. They had, they had, I'm glad it came home, man. Man, I wish I, yo, you know what, though? It's funny, though, because you meet a lot of good brothers in the penitentiary, man. <laughs> I was meeting brothers from all over D.C., Atlanta, Chicago. So, and I knew that, you know, you know, the, the voice is, is, is universal, man. Yeah. And the information that these brothers was providing me, you know, I was like, yeah, I was interested. Not only that, was I interested, but I was infatuated, though, yeah, because yeah, I want to know yeah. about my history. I want to know about my people, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Other than what they tell, what they don't tell you, in history class, you know, this is right here, this is what it is, man. You know, it's always out here, man. You know, communicate with brothers, man, knowing who we really are, man. Gotcha, gotcha.